Welcome back to Crusader Kings 3, playing as Flanders and indeed the Kingdom of Flanders, not just Flanders, because we are just that great. Uh, we just fended off some huge northern invasion, threatening our lives and borders, and I am still kind of struggling a little bit with money and just recuperating basically from all the things that have happened in the very recent past. I wish I could set some... some sort of threshold, because it, the cost doesn't go up repairing the lower durability it has, it seems, so why would I repair it early, really? Why would I do that? We should maybe get ourselves some regalia going. Because we are now a king. And we should definitely have a regalia. So let us go. Why are you doing espionage? You're not. Okay, let's see. Naval speed, siege weapon effectiveness. Yeah, I always go with this. I'm very, very boring in that way. Predictably boring. Okay, these are these are hurting us, so we need to get rid of Ipswich as well. Fine, we'll pay for it. Not like we're getting any choices here. Will our regalia be for our beloved queen, Svetlusa? I mean, sure, why not? Don't really need the prestige right now. Uh, I wanted to check something else. Your husband is that. Good stuff. And your heir. Why is your primary heir him? No, I... what? Why is this man your primary heir? What? Why is not your own son your primary heir? Are you kidding me? More people I have to kill. Let's put him on the list. Incredible. Uh, right. So this went wrong. He's too young yet. Could just give it to him. Or to our heir. Oh my lord. It's fine. We're stopping this. I need to kill you, apparently. For whatever reason. Not exactly what I wanted to do, but here we are. Let's see if we can't invite someone sensibly. <laughs> we, we could, but with the stress levels? No, no. So we need to get rid of this. I always kind of get lost in things. Uh, how do we get rid of this? Let's get rid of these first. Didn't give us anything because they hadn't raided anything yet. It's a bit of a shame, but what can you do?
Are we being raided again? No. Like to be able to stand down. Thank you. <sighs> what do we do with Ipswich? Give it to him. Ah, that's the way. Who's your heir? Your father. Let's get some gold from the good old Pope. Can negotiate an alliance with him. Let's have it. Can I see the succession list here? Yeah. <laughs> but based on the succession, he is the primary heir. And not him. Might be a, a little bit of a bug there. Oh, it might have changed now that he is a count. That might have changed. Do we want him to be fickle? I mean... Kinda. Fickle isn't bad, it just makes you... Not ideal, but it's not bad either. Let's allow him to be fickle. Oh, look at that, he died, so... Who inherited your stuff? M? Who inherited your stuff? I don't see anyone. So we might have taken care of that threat. My king came on to the early of North Nottinghamshire. Stuff. Heck is Nottinghamshire up there. That is Mercia. I don't, I don't think we can even take on Mercia. Oh, we can. And yeah, let's get him in. Okay, let's see. This year... Are you a Muslim? No. Why is your thing looking like it is? Right, so we could press his claim for this silliness. And he becomes our vassal, which is nice. Before, in, in Crusader Kings 2, you had to have him basically on your own uh, roster as a vassal already. Just having a guest pressing their claim wasn't enough. So the West Riding or Nottinghamshire. Nottinghamshire is a bit closer. And we could do it just with our troops. Yeah, I mean, why not? Which is better? How do we know? Can we kind of figure out which is better? Control 800, development 8. That's three slots. This is much better. Has a lot more things. Tax is much higher. Levies are much higher. Nottinghamshire it is. Alright, let's move our little flag in the wind to over here. Raise our mighty, mighty army. Which for some reason is being raised in two spots. We are personally leading, okay. I don't think we have seen battle yet. Should we become reclusive? I think, I think we will be reclusive.
Produced regalia of fine craftsmanship. The cross-bearing orb. Oh. The fertility bonus I don't like much. But it's good overall. Very well done, thank you. I appreciate the work. So this was done well. Why can't I combine my troops? There we go. He is the right leader for this. And we should be able to seclude ourselves. Costing us some prestige, which we have. Goodbye. Let's get that stress down. We'll also hold a grand feast. 200 gold now. Dost thou jest? That's a bit too much for my blood. Okay, we'll take his capital and then move on over to Nottinghamshire directly. Oh, the tax man has just ordered a feast. Let's hold a grand feast. Get some stress reduction going. We are being called to war. We will accept the call. However, we might not be really in a position to help at the moment. I have my own war to fight, but I will surely come once I am done here. Where are his armies? I need to lose stress, not gain more, so we'll have to pay the money. Nothing to be done about it. Uh, an affair was exposed. Doesn't matter much to me. I just want to get this away with pressing escape. Nope, straight into the main menu we go. Battle of Hurstingstone. Well... We become an eager reveler, which I like. It's quite nice. I think we're a novice hunter and an eager reveler. Spent a lot of money and time partying it up, yo. Okay. I think he's coming for our capital. We'll just walk through the fields of death here. Maybe he comes back. Try and take this. Certainly looks like it. How many troops does he have at the moment? Not a lot. That's all he has. So our main income here is 50%. 70% from that. So getting this might just do the trick. And we do have a military engineer on the job. Pregnant again? Woman. Stop it. Well, they are taking this very quickly. I don't like that. Oh, we have a lot further to go than they. So this will take 17% or so off of our war score here. Well, that's okay. Ooh, our daughter is Midas touched. Some good stuff. I don't want to call in dynasty members. Just tell me when it's actually about to break, huh? The enemy is trying to lift the siege, but I'm afraid that might not be possible. Oh, we go into... Ah, sure. Fighting everyone over here, it looks like. But we're still in our own wars. We'll have to go there eventually.
Let's see. How did this battle go? Our levies got quite the beating. His levies too, however. And they killed way more. Our knights did better than his. There's a lot of bowmen though. And some huskarls even. Uh, 16% chance he dies. Sure, let's, let's go. Let's do it. Doesn't matter to me. Uh, he he didn't get killed. But we're not losing anything anymore, so it's not really important at this point. And ransom Earl Rudga now. Oh, a war was just and ended without us ever appearing on the field of battle. That's suboptimal. However, we have won this, so that's nice. And we seized an artifact, the worn language manual after the sea. Oh, we have actually gotten a favor hook. So, um, yeah, time, time to go help here. Maybe, somehow. I don't even know what is enemy and what isn't in, in this. I think this is pretty clearly enemy territory. So going straight for here. Might be best. Let's see about it. Also, some money to go on, but it'll be just fine. Oh no. Another son, who will be what? What will you be? Military focused... Wiemond? Sure. Sounds good. So this guy is gonna lose our stuff again. Because his kid is... Down here somewhere. Where is he? Where are you? Where is this? Uh... Only the, uh, it's a it's a mercenary company, so that shouldn't cost us. No, it does cost us. How is a mercenary company going to cost us land? What? Uh. And I get this title from him. Yes. But it's tyranny. So everyone hates us for it. It gets us stressed like crazy because we're generous. I mean, do we care about keeping this? Kinda? We'll just kill him. Who's next in succession? That would already help. So we can try and kill him. We have tried to kill worse. All right. And with that, I'll leave you to it. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, we'll see you next time, I hope. Until then, bye-bye.